Peace be with you and welcome to Our God Today. We begin our gospel reading on this 18th day of October, 2022. We read from Luke chapter 10. Jesus is sending out the 72 disciples. His instructions are clear. Take nothing extra, just the clothes on your back. When you enter the village and someone welcomes you, take his hospitality. And most importantly, stay there. Don't look for a better position or status home. Bless those who accept your blessing and shake the dust off your feet from those who do not accept your blessing. Do not take their rejection or negative outlook with you. Cure the sick, see to the poor, remind that God is close at hand. Today we celebrate the feast of St. Luke. St. Luke was Greek with a great education. Still, he speaks with simple words and ideas. His understanding of Jesus' journey is clear for all of us to understand. As we look at his words today, we see that we are all called and sent by Jesus into the world. I realize for married people, we are only two of us, and that walk can be easier. Still, as single individuals, you are still called to do the same. Still, in our society today, we find it hard to go out into the world to bring God's healing and message of the kingdom of God. And I know that you will say, you're a deacon, so it's easier for you. Well, when I was a layperson, people rejected me less than when I became a deacon. You see, people expect me to say and share what I share. When you, an everyday person, they are much more surprised when you share God's word. That is the reason Jesus sent the 72 out alone, to help them understand, one, they can do this, and two, they are not alone when they understand the kingdom of God. You never truly walk alone. That Jesus walks with you every day, whether you realize it or not. His very presence to you is within you and about you. Let us pray. Jesus, we thank you for the words of St. Luke. May we take his words into the world that we walk in, live in, and love in. May we never forget your presence. Amen.